Hello everyone. Uh, today I am going to take a seminar on the topic electrical safety analyzer. So, uh, what is an electrical safety analyzer? So, it is an instrument which is used to perform various electrical safety tests and uh, to avoid the electrical shocks to the patients. So, it is basically evaluate the electrical systems, medical devices and physiological instrumentations. So, its compact handheld sizes makes it an ideal addition to service technician. So, it will be served as an instrument for the laboratory purposes. And general safety considerations. There are two uh, icons that is warning and caution symbol. So, this warning symbol shows uh, whenever there will be any harmful uh, happenings in the body. So, the caution denotes any damage in the analyzer or the devices so it ident identifies the condition that could damage the analyzer so these are the two uh, symbols that is used for the safety considerations and instrument familiarity this is the uh, ana uh, analyzer which used to test other instruments and equipments so here the power cords uh, this power cord is uh, uh, supplies the powers to electrical safety analyzer and to the device which are under test so the measurement circuits are energized with the power cord which is plugged into an outlet and there is no on or off switch then outlet indicators so this outlet indicators verify the polarity and uh, only correctly wired outlet should be used so it is not applicable to isolated power systems and uh, uh, function switch so this function switch is uh, provides the direct one step selection of the measurement and uh, a dual position is provided to measure the leakage current um, so these include the lead to ground lead to lead and isolation current next uh, test receptacle so this test receptacle supplies the power to the devices which are under the test and the outlet is powered if the outlet switch is set to normal or reversed and the neutral switch is always closed and uh, neutral switch so this, this neutral switch permits making the leakage current measurements under the open condition so it, which is required by the UL and IEC next uh, outlet switch so this outlet switch is um, uh, used to when the if the center of position there will be no power to the devices under test receptacle uh, then it is recommended that the switch be passed in the center of position uh, before changing the polarity and the lift ground or iso test switch which is a dual function momentary switch and uh, the LED switch which directs the selected patient LED measurement to the desired lead and when testing a 10 LED devices a second pass will be required for the C LEDs and um, CASIS connector so this provides a means for inputting the CASIS cable with its clip to connect the devices under test so uh, this this is measured with the function switch uh, in the resistance position then uh, dual connector is used to make the point to point measurements with optional leads available for purchase and uh, meter which shows the measurement in the digital display and uh, universal patient led terminals and so on in preliminary tests so this preliminary in this preliminary test the analyzer measures the electrical parameters so this the analyzer's work is to measure the electrical parameters so when when any instruments having the voltages and current uh, that should be in a um, reasonable limits when the when those measurements crosses the limits then it leads to hazards so however it is necessary to measure the values um, so that we can able to determine the previous measurements or from the device specifications so the below figure will show the typical line operated instrument with patient connections so this is the device under test which is connected with the analyzer so it is connected to the hard ground and neutral uh, connections 
so this is isolated patient circuits and this is grounded data and control circuits so this is connected via uh, some resistors and inductance so preparing the analyzer for use so the warning is uh, to avoid the possible electric shock uh, we are using this uh, electrical safety analyzer to avoid electric shock and uh, burning of skin personal injury to the patient uh, so uh, before starting the test we should disconnect all the patient connections so that we can avoid these injuries and uh, you should prepare the analyzer for use as follows first uh, to start at this from the same position each time and uh, place the analyzer switch in the following starting positions like function switch in the v line volts led switch in the rl uh, neutral switch should be closed and outlet switch should be off then performing the electrical safety test there are many tests like main voltage test protective earth resistance test main insulation resistance test applied path insulation resistance test earth resistance leakage current test dual leakage current test dual led voltages and so on so features so there are many types in the safety analyzer like ese615 ese614 612 609 and 620 so these types have many features like handheld type onboard memory automation insight and 25a test capability ecg simulation and preferred analyzer for which standard so it measures the standards so the advantages is it is very simple versatile low cost and it allow you to check the protection against electric shock it is uh, necessary for every patient and it allows you to evaluate the safety and quality of a variety of electrical components thank you